I'm Sir Tap Tap, and welcome back to Bunker Punks. We're just... Maybe, like, two or... Yeah, just three things until the final boss. Well, I mean, it's probably not the final, final boss. I mean, there's no way I'm going to beat a roguelike within two or three hours. That's ridiculous. Uh, I would never have such good luck. But, uh... Time for a touch of class. <laughs> Well, at least see the first real yeah, boss. I think I'll take it. Oh god. At least it wasn't one of this things. This things. These things. That would have actually survived that initial salvo and would have hurt. Okay, first things first. Banker's jacket. Tempting, but I'm thinking I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep my defense. Money is not going to help me as much as defense. <sighs> I'm so tired of that exact same shotgun. Excuse you. And the game clearly says, like, shotgun class weapons or something like that, so... It does seem like multiple weapons are planned. They're just all basic right now. I'm not against the early access model or anything. You know, I mentioned before... I don't tend to show off those games. It's mostly because when do you show off an early access game? Like when it comes out, when it first hits early access, uh, somewhere like when it has certain features, like when it's long enough, when it makes a good first impression. I mean, as soon as it's out on early access, I mean, it's game for review. It's being sold for money. So, uh, Two consumers, so I mean, oh god, oh crap, oh frick. I did not want to be in a room with you. Money! Whew! Wasn't actually too bad. I just. The only scary thing was that money drop that I didn't want to lose, so I had to get close to him. I would really like something with anything but melee plus armor, but uh, I just picked that up so it'll appear in my second slot, if that's how that works. I'm not entirely sure how that works, but uh, I think it's the last two items you used. So it seems like enemies have a few seconds where they can't shoot yet if they spawn like right outside the elevator, which is good. Because you won't just instantly die. Comply, obey, conform. Compliance equals profits. Oh. Some good old subtle cyberpunk. Is there any, like, um, political statement making genre that's less subtle than cyberpunk? It's like the political cartoons of, like, literary satire. It's just, or literary illusions, like, it's just so extreme. I guess maybe that's part of the appeal of it. Also, I think ammo, I think we just get ammo for whatever we're currently holding, so. Yeah, I should have switched to my pistol to get that ammo, but, oh, ah! So he's just a normal enemy now. He's just in every room. I mean, he's not insanely impossible to deal with. Oop. How dare you, sir? How freaking dare you? Oh my god, why are you not dead? Why are you not dead? Why are you not dead? Why are you not... What? What was that? Why was he not dead? Ice... Oh, crap. Hello. Okay. Oh, for crap's sake. <sighs> that didn't go too well. We got some tech, though. Oh, <laughs> that friggin' turret is right there. Oh, of course, there's more turrets that are also just right there. Whew. Things are definitely getting more dangerous. Oh, for Pete's sake. 
It's almost like they want to hurt me. <sighs> okay. Just a shotgun. Exact same shotgun I've been ignoring the entire game. Whatever. Oh, right. Alright. Well, Not doing too bad. Move to the country as people are weak and the corporations are strong. The profit. Oh, profit. Get it? Haha. <laughs> I'm sure there's some cyberpunk media thing that has made that allegory, like, painfully obvious. Demo jack- ah. Dang. It's for rocket launchers. No bueno! Ow. Health! Ah, for Pete's sake, he he is he's on every floor. Because if we can kite around him, it's not really a huge deal if we're in the same room as him. Unless you like bump into explosive stuff. Ah, oh, it's that same demolition jacket. Give me assault rifle plus armor. That's all I've ever wanted for Christmas. Alright. Music's alright, too. Very simple controls. That is the whole control scheme right there, and that little tooltip. Or not tooltip, but you know what I mean. Ah! That's just embarrassing. No! My health! How dare you tease me like this game! Yeah, I like Cleopatra so far. Oh. Okay. Let me read this. Now. Ah, oh, for Pete's sake. There's like very few equipment items I want, and they are the ones that I'm not seeing. Like, I saw like a billion runners items, which. Who cares? Oh, another relation to Doom that I have neglected to mention. There's no reloading. You'll probably noticed by now, but uh, it feels nice. You just you just shoot. No complaints. Something I always thought was stupid and brutal. Doom, you know, adding reloading. Just I've never thought. Yeah, I really want to. I wish I could reload. You know. I never played Doom and thought, you know, this game would be better if instead of shooting a bunch of demons and dodging all the time, I had to reload and sit behind some cover for a little bit. You know, instead of just constantly dodging and shooting the stuff. It's just... Sigh. Did I miss? I'm lost. Okay, Tab has changed weapon. It is not... This is not Doom, so there's no map on tab. I just thought maybe. What? Oh. Huh? Some of the offshoot corridors can be a little hard to spot. Because they're in little bits of weird geometry, like, you know, this sideways thing. Wait, did I not go in here? Ah, oh, for Pete's sake. Oh, this could do it again. Yeah, we're in a, when you're in a room with a big guy and a ton of little guys, you kind of just want to clear up the little ones, if you can. <laughs> that feels so good. More games need strafing and, like, circle strafe around stuff. That is one of the best things of Doom and, like, even, um, Metroid Prime. Like, 
I, I really wish more first person shooters were trying to bring strafing and like lock on. Because you can do a lot of really good stuff in uh, first person shooter bosses with lock on. I'm so sad that there's clearly like six more things I could be building, but I can't. I wonder what happens if I get to the end without having like unlocked all of that crap. Yeah, I'm gonna fully upgrade my rifle just so it just so it's easier to pick what to upgrade. Oh man, even the map is doom! I just noticed the map is doom. And it's even got the X marks and this thing. Like, there's even that silo. Like, that th that thing is from Doom. <laughs> I feel so dumb for not noticing that. <sighs> Oof. I have no idea what's gonna happen if I actually survive this boss. I might call it quits after if it like it probably just starts a new game plus and like maybe unlocks even more badass boss. I I don't I don't I honestly don't know. I never get this far in, in roguelikes on stream, or on, you know, on camera. Speaking of roguelikes, um, One Way Heroics, it's getting an enhanced remake. Uh, coming to PS4, PC, Vita... Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. Oh fuck. Nope. Oh, for Pete's sake. So the nano machines, I guess I didn't explain. The nano machines heal you um, based on your combo. So if we get a two-hit combo, we get two HP. I mean combo. It's a kill combo. Oh my god! I knew you were gonna come out at some point. I should have. I should have chased those down. I shouldn't have tried to clear out other areas. I deserve that hit, 100%. And there's still another one. That's the annoying part. You know, there's a map in Plutonia Experiment that just, to start the map, you have to wake up like, scared me, uh, you have to wake up like 10 revenants and oh my god, nope, um, you have to wake up like 10 revenants and they run around in a maze with you and it's just crazy and oh my god, it is right there, it is, oh for Pete's sake, okay, I guess we're taking on this thing before the, I guess the robots, I guess one of them didn't go through the door. Uh, I want to be real careful here. Where are you coming from? I guess from the room the big guy's in. I'm hearing noises and they're, they're very worrying noises. Oh right, this is like the worst possible attack angle too. Or the best possible work angle. <laughs> Why aren't you shooting me, bro? I feel bad for it. I have to do this. I feel bad for it. Oh crap. I don't feel bad for it anymore. I'm low on ammo. Take that, Spider Mastermind. I mean, whatever you were. No, that wasn't a Spider Mastermind. It wasn't nearly annoying enough. Oh god! They were both behind the door! Oh my god, oh my god. No, what is this hell? I'm out of ammo on the second floor! What am I gonna do? Make way for Cleopatra Rex. What am I gonna do? I don't have ammo! I don't have ammo! Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. I'm stuck, I can't... I should have gone back and picked up guns. But those things are after me. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Oh hey, it's a final gift. All the punks receive the following. That's that's neat. Um <sighs> Crap. And I gotta go right back in, because this thing's locked. Dang. I, I knew things would go bad, but <laughs> this is Molly Pop. I'm going in. Uh. 
Oh wait, maybe... Maybe we get two... Wait, no, because... I was thinking maybe everyone has their own equipment and they bring we bring it back. So like you have... You know, I have two people so I get two pieces of equipment. But, I had two equipment slots, like at base, last time. No. I feel so stupid. There were guns all over the floor. What did I think I was gonna do when I got to the next floor? What did I think, horrible robot dog? What did I think? I didn't think. I swear these things have more health than they used to. I mean, they probably do. This loot, or lack thereof, continues to frustrate. Oh yeah, but One Way Heroics, yeah, there's an enhanced... It is that exact same room. Is this the exact same map? This is the same map. I guess I deserve this. I guess I deserve this. Oh man, and this happened because I tried to cheap it out, and it didn't take much damage because of that. That is that is good game design, actually, because I tried to cheap it out, but it, it dealt so little damage. I'm gonna kill these things. I have to. Frickin' die. You die. I know there's another one. These things have way more range than it looks like. Sheesh. It's like a pinky with like 10 times as much health. All right. Not gonna make a fool of me this time, level. Here we go. Oh crap. It's dangerous, but kind of fun and interesting to just rush into a room that you know has enemies. Well, every room has enemies, but you gotta, it, it keeps you on your toes. There's this never loot, proxy man. Another one? Another one? It, I guess this replaces the rocket launcher dude, the not cyber demon. The analog demon. What is this? Ugh, oh, for Pete's sake! Everything sucks and I hate it. I want. Well, I guess this jacket I have is pretty decent anyway. Oh, wait, it was the other way. Oh gosh, it was right there. It could have hit me. Oh my god, there's turrets. There's turrets. There are turrets. I hate those rob turrets. I keep forgetting there's a jump button too. It seems useful for dodging. Take that. Uh -huh. Much better this time. Much better. Full ammo too. All right. Ugh. Just gotta stop being scared by new things. Maybe they're not that bad. That thing isn't really that hard when it's in a room. You know, honestly, the dog things are probably still the most dangerous because they they can chase you down. Almost nothing else will chase you down. But those dog things, those really put pressure on you no matter where you are. Anything else you can sort of take your time with. If the situation is good enough, anyway. All right, what are you? You're garbage. Of course you're garbage. Everything's garbage. I mean, may, may, maybe this wasn't really intended to be a loot shooter. I mean, maybe... Maybe you just pick your guns and... Oh. Probably shouldn't have rushed headlong in here. Got my money. No, my money, my money! I actually love that there's a boss in the room and I'm frantically rushing to get the money. That... That is pretty cool. 
It's dangerous, obviously, and part of me feels like I shouldn't be doing it. Hmm, nah. But it's pretty cool and fun, so I can't really complain. Something's chasing me. Oh god, it's you. I think the pistol has more stopping it power, which makes sense than the rifle. Right. Maybe there just isn't different we weapon go. types at all. Or different loot types. I guess that's... It's not the worst thing in the world. Ah, oh, for Pete's sake. Oh no! Not, not two! Not two! Not two! One is fine, but two... We talked about this. Two is rude. Two is rude! I gotta deal with all this other crap, too. It actually keeps... It keeps advancing while I'm shooting it with this... With the uh, assault rifle. With the pistol, it, it gets kicked back a little bit. It still advances on you. Need it into my nose. <laughs> Only what you need to know. Wasn't there something else? Now oh, whatever, it's fine. Whew! This is pretty intense. Oh, Mr. Crate. Profits are down. Consume. I wonder, did that change because of our actions? Because earlier on it was like, profits are up. I think it also said consume anyway. Alright, got up. Oh, for crying out loud. Alright. Try to be smarter about ammo. I see you, Cyber Demon. I see you, Cyber Demon. Aw, oh, crap. I did not expect that to chain reaction. I, that was dumb. There's one more floor, so I'm gonna see if there's some ammo. I can use specifically pistol. I don't think there is. Wait, now I've been in all the rooms. Okay. Just gotta remember to pick up the ammo drops with the pistol this time. Next floor. Last floor. Here we go. I, what did I just say? I said, ah, oh, for Pete's sake. I said, pick up the stuff with the pistol. I keep forgetting to read them, but the, uh, there's some neat lore and tips in the, uh, loading screen tips. Oh, for Pete's sake. Also, you can harvest ammo from the other gun- from the gun sitting around. Whew. Oh! Hello! Hello, Cyberdemon. Of course you're here. 
The chests keep upgrading, but the loot is still the same. I, never mind. I, I think there is supposed to be better loot, and it just isn't an in game yet. Oh my god. Because the chests keep looking better, but what's in them does not. Is it actually going through that door? That was dumb and unsafe. I guess it's more like an Arachnatron than a Cyber Demon. Or Spider Mastermind, rather. How dare your sprite, how dare you have a sprite so big that I can't see past it after you're dead? How dare you? I heard bad guy noises. Oh, never mind. Whew! Okay. We're. I'm gonna call that a wrap. I. Oof. I need to not be in a chair for a few minutes, honestly. Uh, and then. Oof. And then we'll try not to die to the final boss, or whatever boss this is. I can't imagine this is actually the end, but maybe. I mean, probably unlocks better bosses. I don't know. We'll see after the split.